Hello YouTube audience! Welcome to a, a video game that you never expected to see again. And that is the ultimate, the iconic, the one and only Five Nights at Freddy's. Uh, copyright 2014 by Scott Cawthon. D don't mind the makeup, I was just doing a cosplay for the lovely TikTok app. Um, <laughs> Speaking of TikTok, this video game and this video game franchise has become a lot more popular recently with like, you know, audios, the songs, especially the songs, cosplays, and I couldn't be happier because I never exited my phase. I always think about, you know, those poor children and the man behind the slaughter. So, um, I do have a confession though, I have never played this on PC. I've played it on the phone. I think I played it one time on like some other kind of handheld device. I never played it on the infamous PC. Um, years later though, it is now only $5 on Steam as of today, April 10th. Uh, 2020. I am currently stuck in quarantine, so that I am spending all my money on things I do not need. <sighs> this is a really new experience for me. I hope it's a new experience for you. But uh, I have a pretty good grasp on how to play. I just never actually have done it. I'm also really bad with scary games, so I hope that this is some nightmare fuel for you. All right, new game. Here we go. Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, Help Wanted, Family Pizzeria looking for security guard to the night shift, 12 a.m. to 6 a.m. Fuck. <gasps> I'm scared already. Oh my god, guys. I'm kind of scared, though. I'm kind of scared. I'm scared. I don't know what was that, guys, and I didn't do that. I'm scared. I haven't played this in so long. Why does it move so slow? Answer the fucking phone. Hello? Hello, hello? Uh, I wanted to record a message for you to help you get settled in on your first night. Um, I actually worked in that office before you. I'm finishing up my last week now, as a matter of fact, so I know it can be a bit overwhelming. But I'm here to tell you, there's nothing to worry about. Uh, you'll be fine. So let's just focus on getting you through your first week, okay? Uh, let's see. First, there's an introductory greeting from the company that I'm supposed to read. Uh, it's kind of a legal thing, you know. Um, welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, a magical place for kids and grown-ups alike, where fantasy and fun come to life. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for damage to property or person. Upon discovering that damage or death has occurred, a missing person report will be filed within 90 days or as soon as property and premises have been thoroughly cleaned and bleached and the carpets have been replaced. Blah, blah, blah. Now, that might sound bad, I know, but there's really nothing to worry about. Uh, the animatronic characters here do get a bit quirky at night, but do I blame them? No. If I were forced to sing, those same stupid songs for 20 years, I never got a bath, I'd probably be a bit irritable at night too. So remember, these characters hold a special place in the hearts of children and we need to show them a little respect, right? Okay. So just be aware, the characters do tend to wander a bit. Uh, they're left in some kind of free roaming mode at night. Uh, something about their servos locking up, they get turned off for too long. Uh, they used to be allowed to walk around during the day, too, but then there was the bite of 87. The bite of 87! It's amazing that the human body can It's already been an hour, bro. This guy's been talking for a solid hour. Uh, now, concerning your safety, the only real risk to you as a night watchman here, if any, is the fact that these characters uh, if they happen to see you after hours, probably won't recognize you as a person. They'll, they'll most likely see you as a metal endoskeleton without its costume. I still have five hours to go. Since against the rules here at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, they'll probably try to forcefully stuff you inside a Freddy Fazbear suit. Um, what? Now, that wouldn't be so bad if the suits themselves weren't filled with cross beams, wires, and animatronic devices especially around the facial area. 
So you can imagine how having your head forcibly pressed inside one of those could cause a bit of discomfort and death. Uh, the only parts of you that would likely see the light of day again would be your eyeballs and teeth that pop up in front of the mask. Either. Yeah, they don't tell you these things when you sign up. But hey, first station of the breeze. I'll chat with you tomorrow. Uh, check those cameras and remember to close the doors only if absolutely necessary. I'm really scared. I'm scared. Gotta conserve power. Alright, good night. <sighs> I'm like sweating already. <gasps> cupcake! The cupcake! So how are, how's your guys' day been? <laughs> you know, this game is pretty scary but also low-key boring at times. I hope these stupid idiots don't move from the fucking places. It's been it it's been two hours and I have wasted like twenty five percent of my battery. This is terrible. Why? Just because I've been breathing? Well, I guess we're stuck here. Um, I'm really scared about uh, for a jump scare. Wait, did he start moving? They didn't. Thank God. It's been three hours and I can and I wasted thirty percent of my battery. So, at this rate, I should have at least 50% by the night's end. Why did I take the fucking night shift, bruh? Celebrate. CELEBRATE! We're in quarantine and we need to CELEBRATE! Do 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 Hey, LMAO. Oh wait, we missed LMAO. <gasps> oh my god, Bonnie moved. Oh my god, he's in the dining area. I'm scared. Okay, I know that he comes through the left. So we'll just make sure to watch that. We'll make sure to watch the dining area. Oh, he's gone. Oh, he's in the back. He's in the backstage. Dope. Sounds good. Um, he's coming towards us. That's for damn sure. <gasps> that is so scary. Okay, well, he's gone. Oh, he's coming down the hall. Make sure to turn on the light and stuff. I'm really scared. Oh, he's not there anymore. Oh, he's in the supply closet, bitch. Why? Oh, is that. Oh, is Chica coming too? scared now. Um, jeez. <sighs> Close the fucking door. Oh. oh my god. Is he still there? Oh my god, I only have an hour left. If he's still there or not. Oh, he's gone. Oh, she's in the kitchen. It's gonna be 6 a.m. in like a sec. I hear her coming. Where is she? Oh, she's coming. She's coming down past the restrooms. Oh my god, I didn't even see him there! Oh my god! He was there that whole time! Why did he come back? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Oh, Chica's still in the restrooms. Why is it not 6 a.m. yet? Oh! <laughs> One jump ahead of the bread line. This is stressful, but like, on a quiet level. Jesus fucking Christ, no- Oh no no, how do I save? I don't have the energy for this, oh my god. That was rough. I need to go eat, I'm hungry. No, mm-mm. How do I exit? Stop. Please. Ah, what do you want? Please! Get me out of here. Oh, I just exited the whole game.
that was scary. Uh, let me just inflate myself a little bit here. I will, I will play more, you know, like I will have more episodes of this, but the, um, <laughs> I just don't do well with those kinds of things. Next episode will be night two. If this thing fucking saved. Um, hopefully, this wasn't that scary, honestly, but like, it just, it's scary, you know, it's like suspenseful, it's like, ee -hee! So I'm gonna get a head start on <laughs> editing this video, uploading it, probably tonight, because it was very short. I'm gonna go eat, and we'll see what happens from there, but thanks for watching, this is my comeback to YouTube. I'm a puppet